Hello everyone, I'm Rachel Lowe from Physiopedia and we're excited to welcome you to week one of the course Managing Children with Cerebral Palsy. So I am here talking today to Zion Devet, who's from ICRC and has been working with um, our team of ICRC facilitators to put this course together. Hi Zion. Hi, morning Rachel. Hi, um, so we're excited to be starting week one finally after all this work to put the course together. Um, we have around eight and a half, currently eight and a half thousand people registered to take part in the course. So we're very excited to start week one. Um, so you work for the International Committee of the Red Cross. Uh, you have been coordinating our team of facilitators to bring all the resources together and build this course. So maybe maybe you could just you'll be around for the course perhaps not in the forums but you'll be around in the background helping keep, pull this course together so so maybe you could just say hi to everyone introduce yourselves just tell people a little about who you are and what you do um, and then we can have a chat about week one excellent thanks rachel um so um i'm uh, zion devet working with the icrc special fund for the disabled currently working in tanzania um, and I've been um, working with our team of um, orthotists and physiotherapists to uh, coordinate this, uh, the, the content for our um, course on managing children with cerebral palsy. Um, and I look, very, uh, I look forward to, to getting the, the course up and running and um, look forward to uh, learning from all the experiences and knowledges of, of, from everyone that will participate. And um, yeah, I'm uh, very keen to see how many um, different professionals will also participate, not only physiotherapists and prosthetist orthotists, but um, everyone else who is interested in learning more about cerebral palsy and um, yeah, sharing their knowledge and experiences from across the globe. Yeah, I think that's going to be a really good part of the course to bring um, so many different disciplines together, healthcare professionals from so many different contexts all over the world. Um, I think we can learn, a, we can all learn a lot from each other. So I think, I mean, on that note, it's really important for everyone to remember that you're not just a learner on this course. So you're also, you know, you can learn a lot with the knowledge that we'll go through over the next six weeks, but you're also a teacher. You know, you have your own unique experiences and it's really important to share those with everyone because we can all learn something from each other. So just remember that you're a learner and a teacher on this course. Um, so Zion, maybe you could just give us a little introduction to what we can all expect to come across in week one. Okay, great. Well, uh, week one is really an introduction to uh, cerebral palsy and um, understanding cerebral palsy so that we can uh, better manage children who um, have uh, cerebral palsy. We will be looking at um, some of the objectives, um, just characterizing cerebral palsy and describing how it influences the brain and uh, movement and posture of, uh, of your individuals. We also want to look at the um, global prevalence of cerebral palsy and how it's managed in different parts of the world and um, just to identify problems with uh, some individuals that um, they may face uh, with cerebral palsy. And we also need to recognize how important it is to have a team of professionals um, working together with um, uh, when you're managing ch children with cerebral palsy. Interdisciplinary or, or multidisciplinary approach is always uh, the best way forward. Yeah, so week one's a kind of introduction, isn't it, to all the general principles around cerebral palsy. Um, it's It'll be revision for some people, it'll be brand new for others. So if you, you know, um, enjoy the learning this week, if, it, if it's not new to you, if you already have quite a lot of experience in cerebral palsy, you know, it may just be a revision, but hopefully you'll get something from all the additional resources that we provide as well. Um, and yeah, like I said before, in the discussion forums, everyone's got a unique experience to help um, that others can learn from. So it's always good for you to be there as well however much experience you have we enjoy having you on the course so that's a great introduction we're excited to launch into week one um have you got any other final messages for the course participants Zion, to help them get through this course 
Um, I would uh, I would like to get everyone on board uh, with the forums so that the discussion is rich with knowledge and experience, uh, not only from our physiotherapists and pr uh, prosthetists, orthotists, but also nurses and doctors and, and other uh, professions who um, who work uh, regularly with uh, children with cerebral palsy. Uh, we have some OTs on board with the course uh, as facilitators as well, and um, I think it's uh, it will be an interesting. Um, mix of, of knowledge with 8,000 people across the globe. So definitely get involved and uh, make sure you participate in forums and discussions. And um, all the best. Brilliant. Um, okay, well, thanks very much, Sion. I'm sure we'll um, see you again at some time later in the course. Um, so thanks for chatting to us today. Thank you very much, Rachel. All the best.